Continuamos en Hasbro Star Wars y vamos a seguir comentando qué es lo que viene ahora. What's new? With What's new? So let's talk Blade Builders. Uh, have you heard of Blade Builders before? Yeah. This is one of their biggest lines. It's a fully customizable system of lightsabers. So essentially you buy different packs and there's over hundreds of combinations that you can make each piece uh, works with another piece. So they have a brand new Force Master lightsaber. I'm going to grab it for you right here. For the first time, you're going to get four different light and sound combinations, and you're going to get to choose your master. So I'll turn it on. Of course, here we have, so we have Mace Window. You are able to hear speak a little bit, and then we can turn it Obi Wan Kenobi. Darth Vader, of course. And our friend Yoda here. So you're going to get four different options, and you can play with whichever master you like. You have your awesome lightsaber play. It's going to be able to detect when you're moving. So this is brand new for the Blade Builders collection. You guys want to see some stuff over here as well. Um, so here we have Force Link. I'm going to show you this band. Force Link came out last year, and the purpose was to really bring the three three quarter inch world alive because it's great for kids. It's great for that the um, adding all the different collections and playing. So I'm going to grab Han over here and just give you an example. It's able to detect which character you're playing with. Call me Han Solo, right? A bunch of different sound effects and phrases. Um, if I grab Finn over here, you'll hear something completely different. His pat, yeah, exactly. So it works. It works with accessories and vehicles. Right now, when I'm hitting it, it's getting the accessory. Whereas, let's see if I can actually get Finn. Yeah, it's getting the accessory. Earlier, he was saying, "I'm with the resistance." Um, so you have that. That's very cool. They're updating it this year to be uh, Forcing 2.0. So now it's going to have Bluetooth. This is going to allow for you to download an um, an app which is going to update the Force Link every time new characters come out. So you'll get all of the phrases and sound effects. Keep up to date with that. But it's also great for social play. So let's say you have one of these and I have one. We're going to take two different characters and it will interact based on which characters you're playing with. So for example, if I have Han and you have Chewie, they're going to be able to talk to each other. But it'll be different than if I have Han and you have Leia. So that's really cool with Force Link. And then here you're going to see um, it's going to come in a starter set. And that will give you Han in there as well. And you'll get the band. You can get double pack or you can get it, of course, in singles. And then over here, they are coming out with the creature pack. So the creature will also work with the force link. You can see the Wampa right there. So cool. He comes with uh, Luke Skywalker. But they'll come out with a bunch of different combinations of creature as well. Um, and then up here, we have Micro Force. Those are our crazy cute collectibles. You know, it's they come in these blind bags, um, two ninety nine, and there's a bunch. There's like eighty different combinations. So as you can see, kids love them. They're really cool. Anyone really who loves to collect, they're just so fun. They're really cute. I mean, they're so cute. I know. I know it's great. And then of course, oh no, Yoda's down. Um, on the opposite scale of these little minis, we have our hero series. Mm -hmm. This is a 12 inch scale. This is really for your crash and bash play, for those kids who just kind of want to hit them together. So you can do that. They're not, and they're not super delicate, but the detail is still amazing. And we have some new solo characters. We have our deluxe Chewbacca back there. Um, and then continuing down here, we have some more. We have our Nerf blasters, which uses glow strike technology. So we'll be coming out with more. This is a nice little taste from the Solo movie. This is Han Solo's blaster. Um, and the glow strike technology of the darts really make it a nice simulation of a Star Wars battle, right? Because it's glow in the dark and you have them shooting everywhere. It's great. And then more masks. These are great because um, for the first time, we're able to give you light up sabers. Let's see if this one is. It's hard to see in the light right now, but it lights up. And this is the first time a saber lights up for under 10 price point. Mm. So this is great because it's allowing all different price points throughout the line to enjoy Star Wars. For the younglings. Yes, exactly. 